Hello, and welcome to episode 16 Woo. of the Two Guys Talking <laughs> Booze podcast. That's as a always, lot, that's a lot. That's a lot. 16. That's like twice as much as eight. And uh, <laughs> this is my boy Danny. And my boy Ricardo. And today, um, as promised during our unboxing of a little while ago, we are opening up a honey vodka that was sent to us by Eric and Sylvia Dudor from the vintage distilling. This is so nice. That's amazing. This Thank is you. so nice. So much. Show that beautiful bottle. It yeah. is it's, so cool. It's, a, it's our first bottle gift. It is. It's it's our, our first gift. Gift, yeah. And they reached out on Instagram and they said they want us to try and, and review this. And I will tell you this. This is going to be it's our honest one. review. Uh, this is not in any way. This isn't like a, a sponsorship or anything like that. They're not paying us for the review. They just, out of the goodness of their heart, asked me for their my address, and they sent the bottle. So yeah. thank you guys. You guys are awesome. You're doing great things. So uh, while he opens the bottle, you know, uh, you can get this bottle at VintageDistilling.com, direct from the source for $39.99. You can get it at Total Wine for $36.99. Okay. And also at reservebar.com for 45 bucks. So I, I told you how to cork. I've been having no, issues opening no, 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 every no, no. single you, bottle. You pull like this. All right, but it's a little cork. You're right, right? The little cork. He was right. Oh, smell it. Smell that. Fingers. No, that's uh, honey, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't wash his hands. So uh, uh, so we were happy. They um, they started as a hobby, you know, making the these vodkas Oof. and it was from you know their their grandparents and their parents they did this vodka and it turned into a business they opened up in 2020 and then bam oh wow so they actually just opened like, yeah well, 2020 well, some wow. people say 2017 i think is when they started working on stuff but the pandemic hit them so they had their official opening in 2022 okay uh, in los angeles and let me tell you they've won a bunch of awards They've won uh, awards by the Wine Enthusiast, uh, the SIP Awards, S-I-P, eh, clever, and the San Francisco International uh, Spirits Competition. So I, I never knew, though, that there was any, there was a honey vodka. I know. And this is like the first time I even get to hear about this. Yeah. So I yeah. find this pretty cool. And it even looks like honey. It, it has this cloudiness to it, like in the color. I don't know if you guys could yeah, tell. And the honeycomb too. Right. The, the honeycombs and, and, and just the color is very cloudy. It's very uh, honey like. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. It's made from natural honey without right. without any additives. Right. That, so this is a legit. cool thing. Another really cool thing about this honey vodka is uh, parts of the proceeds go towards the B, B E E, like right, this right. kind foundation. And they okay. they educate the people about bees and uh, and how to you know the conserving them and it, it stimulates and uh, motivates uh, bee innkeepers yeah. uh, to do their thing. So they're they're doing something good with the world, man. For so sure, awesome for now. sure, because bees are important. We have to understand that bees are life. For some reason, if bees are not here, <laughs> we will not be. We, we will won't not be, be here. here. They so, pollinate. Yeah. The stuff you know gets cross pollinated all over the place. All that it, stuff. Plant stuff. It's it's it's. It's important for life. Like, you know, we reproduce or he reproduces with his wife having children. <laughs> uh, the bees help the trees reproduce and the flowers and yeah, the plants. Yeah. And it's a stuff. good cause, man. And I, I like, like it. I like when, when, when a business is done with a purpose. You yeah. Know? And especially giving. So look at this. Look at, look at the cloudiness he's talking about. He's my brother. Um, so what we're looking at here, that is a, a beautiful it's gold. Nice and thick, huh? Yeah, okay. yeah. All right. Let's do to the nose. Oh wow! Oh, that, that is, is honey. That, is that honey, man? It's a very bold and clear aroma of honey. Yeah. I mean, you can't put it any other way. Now, you ready to taste it? <laughs> yeah, of course. Cheers! You are, cheers! Cheers! And guys. Cheers! Thank you, Erica and Sylvia. Thank you, Erica. Let's see what we got here. Yep. Oh my gosh! This is some good stuff. Oh my gosh! I've never tasted something like this. No, no, no. he's not a vodka fan. Oh, wow. Mm. So the palate, soft and surprisingly clean, non-syrupy, yep. strong, clear flavors of natural honey. Dude, that's a good description. Where do you get that? I got it from their website. Oh, yeah. So uh, <laughs> they, know what they, they know what they're talking about. Um, like, and the palate is soft and smooth, right? Mm. With a warm sweetness. Wow, this is, I have never had anything like this. Me neither. Like anything like this, and uh, 
We, we can't stop drinking it. <laughs> it's almost like a honey liqueur. Mm. It's almost not about... It goes super smooth, too. It, it, for me, it tastes more like... Uh, like a dessert vodka, yeah, a dessert that vodka, be, a liqueur, be. you know, liqueur, yeah, amazing. So today's episode, while we're enjoying this delicious um, honey vodka, right? What's this up? is the Thanksgiving weekend. That's true. So you know, we are very thankful for our our followers. We're thankful for, for, for our fans, for our fans, uh, our the, sixteen of you guys, the, the groupies <laughs> that are nonstop. You know. Like, <laughs> And um, <laughs> I, I, I personally, I'm, I'm thankful for my wife and my amazing family, uh, even my dogs when they misbehave. Um, I'm thankful for my health, you know, I'm 52 and still kicking it. Man, you look good, man. Oh, thanks, man. You know, I, work, I worked out a couple of months ago. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> thankful for my friend, Danny, yeah. uh, that, that puts up with, you know, he's tired. He's got I'm the kids. I'm fucking exhausted. <laughs> hey, hey, Sorry. It's all good. Happy Thanksgiving episode. <laughs> and then, uh, <laughs> That's right. I mean, well, I'm exhausted, dude. Having two kids is not an easy task. Two babies. Two babies. Two A toddler yeah. and a baby. So I, I'm you know. thankful that you come um, to the studio, my house. The library. The studio. Yeah. And uh, that you do this, man. It, I know it's not easy, so I'm thankful no, for that. Man, I appreciate that. And she is. I'm also thankful for you. I'm thankful for my family, Oop. for my boys, Santi and, and Sebastian, and the roof over my head, for sure. Because you suck to be homeless, right? Yeah, man. It sucks. And, you know, uh, so uh, shout out to you guys um, out there struggling and uh, know we'll that feel you. everything good and everything bad in this world, it's all temporary. You're going to get through it. So um, cheers to you guys. And uh, words. we're thankful for Eric and Sylvia and uh, the good people at Vintage Distilling. Yeah, this was great, man. This was, this great. was great. I'm excited. All right. Thank cheers, you, guys. Cheers, guys. It was great.